everyone! In today's video, I will be making soybean, black bean noodles with seafood. Um, you know, you guys know that I usually, my mukbang is based on whatever I crave and you know, I've already done soybean, no, not soybean, black bean noodles, but you know, I don't mind repeating a lot of stuff on my mukbang because I mean, why not? But with recipes though, I wish it was a little bit more different. If you, if, if I'm doing something, if I was doing black bean noodles with exactly the same recipe, I wouldn't be doing all this cooking, but because it's slightly different and I am adding soybean paste to it, I wanted to show you guys um, how I'm gonna try, um, make it, I guess. This is my first time. I don't know how it's gonna taste. It's either going to be a really, really good combination or it'll taste the same. It wouldn't make any difference um, and be wasting my time. But anyways, yeah, let's start. Everything is really pretty much the same. You just have to add soybean paste. So, add the And add, I have some zucchini, onions, and cabbage. Let's add all of it. I'm trying to get in the habit of seasoning everything. Salt. And some black pepper. Some seafood mix. I have fresh mussels and uh, shrimp in here, which I'm going to add later actually. Or, you know, I don't know. What do I do? Just a little bit. Maybe I could add shrimp right now. I'm gonna start taking out only the vegetables and the small seafood mix. I'm gonna leave the shrimps in here so they could cook a little bit longer. So I have some black bean paste. I'm going to add like that much. Oh, don't get on me! It's everywhere. Oh, okay, that just made it worse. Oh. Fast, fast, fast. Let's add small spoonful of soybean paste. That much? That much? Ugh. And then some sugar. Yeah, I like my sweet. There we go. And I actually want to add like a half more of the black bean paste. Whatever. Let's just add water. and shrimp and everything. Let's just add it right now. Whatever. Now it looks more like it, you know? It looks more legitimate and what it's supposed to look like. Okay, and I know that some people keep telling me not to use the plastic spoon over heat and I know and I don't know why I keep using it but I really like the size of the spoon. It's perfect. So I gotta look for like a non-metal, maybe wooden spoon like this but I'll, I'll keep that in mind. I'll try not to use it. But I really like it. Good. Okay, right now I think I could just start adding the mussels because I want them to cook too. And then after this, I'm gonna start seasoning it with like maybe salt or soy sauce or and more sugar if I need it. Okay. Let's just add more, a little bit more water. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
Oh shoot, you know what I forgot? Let's actually add a little bit more water. Just like a tiny bit more. And then on here, you know what we're supposed to add? We're supposed to add starch water. Let's make sure it's still there. Okay. Starch water. So they will thicken up really good. I'm going to add some black bean noodles. Yes. I'm going to add this too much. I was gonna put it as a garnish, but I don't think there's really no use for this because you can't really see it. And some fried eggs. Yeah, this is not going to do anything. This doesn't even look good. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna mix it in. I'm gonna take this out. Okay, and then on the side, I have some deep fried dumplings. Let's poke it in here. Yummy! Alright, let's eat! It's kind of like budang right now. You know what to do when your noodles or jajangmyeon is getting... You know, they're sticky, they're gonna dry it out. Add some soup. Add some like jjampong soup or any kind of like good broth. But usually jjampong because you know people... But usually it's um, jampong because you know when you order black bean noodles you um, order jampong and instead of adding water it adds more flavor so oh I should go downstairs because I have to pick up my package but anyways let's try it already I can I'm not worried this looks so good okay let's try the noodles oh my god. Oh my god. Hello, talk. Mm -hmm. Where's the button for this? Okay, this one's cute. I'm gonna leave it like that. It's not too distracting, right? I'll turn it off later. But mmm, some shrimp. Mm. Honestly, I don't really taste the soybean paste. Maybe I'm just not good at it, but it tastes good. Okay, I, but I don't know if it's good because it's just. You know, black bean noodles because I love it. But I mean, it was a lot saltier as you guys saw, probably because of the soybean paste. So I have to add a lot more sugar. I have some tamuji. There you go. Yes. I am so hungry. Mm. Oh my god. Try the shrimp. The shrimp.
dumplings. But honestly, I feel like adding the soybean paste doesn't really make that much of a difference. I mean, it tastes good. Maybe it did something, but to me, I'd rather save that spoon. I'd rather save that like one spoonful of soybean paste and then use it in my soybean paste soup later than adding it here. You know, it's kind of like unnecessary step, I think. Do you see Ahmed? Oh, he's also he's in the balcony because it's so cold outside. It's oh my god, he loves that. Even um, well last winter when it was snowing and we had a backyard, um, he didn't come in. He literally stayed like in the snow, rolling around for at least two hours. And I was actually getting worried that he might get. He, um, I was surprised that he wasn't getting cold or. Or, you know, he felt like he wanted to go come in, but he actually didn't. I actually had to force him in because I guess he, that much hair, I mean, like, I know, it, like, you know, it's hot. But I didn't know it kept him that warm, even during in the snow. In the, in the snow, when he was getting, like, clumps of snow everywhere, he looked like he was becoming a seal. You know those white seals? Oh, my gosh, he's so cute. I'm going to dedicate, like, a whole video when it first snows with Ame. Oh, he's so cute. So when he first saw snow when he was a puppy, oh my god, it was the funniest thing ever. He was so scared. He's like, what is this cold thing? But it feels so good. By the way, the soup here is actually the instant instant ramen soup. But the you know the jampong version, the jampong uh, instant noodles that Korean people like Korea went crazy with for a little bit. I feel like every brand came up with their own the jampong instant ramen. So. Uh, something is really spicy. I don't know what it is. Oh, I love muscles. I think I would prefer seafood black bean noodles. I think it's a pretty good combination. Mm.
And this is one of my favorite instant noodle soup. I made some fried rice because I thought I'd be hungry, but I think when I was so when I was cooking the noodles, I looked at it. I'm like, this is no way. This is like three bite. Okay, and then I was like, okay, well, let's just add a little bit more, and I should have added that a little bit more. But that's why I made some fried rice because I thought the only reason why I want to make little noodles is because I want to eat some fried rice, but. Okay, well, let's just try the fried rice. Mmm. Mmm. Oishi. That means it's good in Japanese. I'm so ready to go to Japan right now. I still have a month or so.
Nope. Nope. This one doesn't look good. There is nothing in here. I oh, shit, what is that? Oh my god. What the hell? My pizza cup. I just try to eat really clean. So like, oops. Well, this is not clean at all actually, but I'm gonna try to keep the sauce so I could eat it with the fried rice. Oh my God, it's actually very good. I think I prefer the fried rice over the noodles actually. It's good. Yeah, I made way too many, well, I made way too much noodles. Nah. Which I kind of regret doing, but too late. Oh, yeah. Yes. Hmm. I don't mind either peeled or non. Peeled, honestly, I could eat both, but I guess whatever I'm in the mood for. Like right now, I don't mind peeling it, but sometimes I just feel really lazy. That's why I don't peel it. But this is really gross. If I have to pick regular jajangmyeon, seafood jajangmyeon, definitely seafood jajangmyeon, but I'm sure it's gonna be more pricey. Hey guys, so my camera um, shut down and lost, you know, I had no more batteries and I just have like this much food left. It looks disgusting, right? But I guess I'm gonna film it here and show you guys how... Because, you know, I really want to finish my food because, you know, that sometimes a lot of people feel satisfied that way. So, I'm just gonna do my camera mukbang. Here we go. So we yeah, have just a little bit of food left here, just a little bit. <laughs> I don't know how much my phone can record because I have a, like, my phone can record up to like, not that much. This is not like six gigabytes. This is like, I think I got the smallest one, with the memories. So I can't do this for a long time, but. Mm. I'm just going to. See, this is the leftover sauce part that I'm gonna save it for later with my fried rice. 
but this part. Mmm. That's a good book. I really need to buy an extra charger for my camera because it always runs out. So by the time I'm like I'm almost done with my food, but I still have like you know, a little bit more to go. It's running. It's you know blinking. That it's it's out of battery. And especially I'm worried when I go to Korea and I'm gonna need another. I'm gonna be filming all day, you know. So I'm gonna or recording all day for my vlog. So I'm gonna get another charger. It's like a battery pack. But if my phone can't record anymore, then that's it too. <gasps> that's gonna be it. I can't, I don't have all the cameras. There's a Sony camera that I used to use when I first started Mukbang, but it was, I don't know what happened, it broke. And I took it to the shop and then they fixed it. <clears throat> They didn't charge me a lot because they said <clears throat> it's not a big deal. So I thought, okay, pay forty dollars. Literally the next day it broke again. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. I don't know if I should just take it somewhere else and fix it for more money. But the camera itself was not that expensive, so I feel like I'm gonna pay more to fix the camera. You know. You know, this <clears throat> soup is good. Ah. You know, bad thing about black noodles? It's everywhere. But this definitely was like a meal. And I'm glad that I'm finishing it. <laughs> mm, you know why my phone can record a lot more than I think right now? It's because, like yesterday or two days ago, I deleted at least 600 photos. Yeah. So, I have... I wanted to save a lot of space. I wanted to make a lot of room on my phone because now I'm taking a lot of photos soon in Korea. And I've been downloading a lot of apps for Korea and Japan, like maps and food and like, you know, Airbnb. So, what the hell is that? What the fuck? Oh my god. Um, that's from shrimp. Oh, that's good. But, look guys, seriously, this rice, it has, um, yeah, it just, it's just, um, rice and two eggs. This is so good. You, for this fried rice, if you want to mix it in the bread bean noodles, it's better if it's more bland or simple because the, so the black bean noodles, it's sauce itself, itself has really good. Because the black bean noodle sauce, it stuff has really like you know too much flavor anyways. It's enough. Mm. Mm -hmm. No. Let's see, Ame. Let's see. Oh, it's right there. We just came back from the park, so. <sighs> but yeah, that worked out very well. No, is this off? No, this is on. Why is it like not doing? Oh, I got a burp. 
all right guys thanks for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more i'm not sure the rest of this week I'm, i don't know if i'm gonna film another one or not it's because i can't think right now because i am so full but um yeah i just want to thank you guys for watching thanks for always supporting me and do check out the vlogging channel because um i think i changed the style just a little bit it's always um before i want to vlog about just my life in general but recently i don't know just my life is not that fun so i decided to just um go on like fun dates with tong and i, I want to vlog that like you know kind of like a reality show but <laughs> i don't know but let's see how that goes so do check that out um because i am so excited for that i'm gonna invest more time in that now that's why i mean i am of course that this is my main channel so i want to up um the reason you guys know the reason why i can't i don't upload a lot on this channel is because i am on a diet and until i reach a certain point i don't want to upload as much um but but eventually i'm gonna be uploading a lot more soon it won't it won't be too long it won't be, it may be a couple months you know but yeah that's that and vlogging channel i want to spend more time on it make it really, i'm gonna build it up really good so you guys enjoy watching it and um yeah so thanks for watching guys love you guys bye